Coming off a six-point loss to DeKalb, Wabonzi looks to bounce back against a hot Niqua team that is riding the high of a 30-point win over Mattia. Starting off the first quarter strong is Wabonzi's Hannah Lobb, who drives to the net and gets a couple of points for Dove V. Getting the ball in the corner is Niqua's Jessica Sun, who fires in the three-pointer, giving Niqua the early advantage 8-6. After a mad scramble in the paint, the ball finds Nikwa's Caitlin Washington, and she buries the three-pointer. Nikwa starting to pull away late in the first quarter, 17-8. With time winding down, the ball hits the hands of Wobanzi's Amari Banks, and her quick trigger three-pointer finds the bottom of the net. 19-11 Nikwa going to the second. Starting the next quarter hot, Ellie Wisner gets the feed and shoots the three, Nikwa up 15, 26-11, 4.44 to go in the first half. Again, a fast counter by Nikwa as Caitlin Washington takes it herself and scores the bucket. Nikwa on a 20-point run. Scoring the only points for Dove V in the second quarter is Wobanzi's Lauren Threat after she picks up the offensive rebound and put back. Nikwa up 30 going into the locker room for halftime. Early on in the third quarter off a quick restart, the ball finds Nikwa Valley's Kylie Norcus, who shoots the three-pointer, putting her team up 46-13. In basically the same spot on the next possession, Norcus shoots another three that extends Nikwa's advantage 49-13, 7.09 to go, third quarter. Another fast break attack by Nikwa, this time Wisner scores, 51-13 Nikwa, 4.01 to go in the third. They're able to hold Wobanzi off the score sheet in the third quarter. Now in the fourth quarter, bringing the ball in past the three-point line and settling for the long two, Wabonzi's Lauren McKnight finally getting Dub V some points. Late in the contest, bringing the ball in all alone is McKnight, who lays it in for two more points, and despite McKnight's late efforts, Wabonzi falls to Nikwa in the War of 204 by a score of 55-22. to Sometimes we're off to a slow start, which isn't always good for starting, but we need to keep up the tempo and that helps us finish through, especially with def defensively, because that always um, helps more possessions offensively. It all starts on the defensive end. I mean, we just wanted to put pressure on them and make them feel uncomfortable, and that's how we got as many points up on the board as we did. And then it translated to the offensive end, getting easy buckets on the other end. 